family parties can be a fucking nightmare. Because <laughs> you turn up and all the generations are there. And what happens is the teenagers hang around, just hang around, talk to the old people. Teenagers are very serious people now. Oh, they're so earnest and serious. They come across, they've got their tofu. I've got my tofu, I've got my mineral water, I'm going fucking mental tonight. <laughs> And they come over to you, hi, hi, I'm Tom, I'm Tom, I'm six foot seven, I'm 15. <laughs> this is India. We met in Africa. We were building a well for the locals, you know. They didn't want it, but fuck it, we built it anyway. <laughs> We're going on a march tomorrow, Mick, against lactose intolerance. Would you like to come along? <laughs> Over Tom's shoulder is a slightly overweight, balding man looking at me and going... Obviously. I fancy it. Who don't fancy a live at a family party? I don't do it because I'm terrified. Terrified of having a fucking heart attack. I don't want to be that bloke stretched out at half past ten, ruining the party. What's the matter with him? Oh, he's having chest pains, apparently. And I just know the paramedics are going to mess with me. Mr. Flanagan, what have you taken, Mr. Flanagan? It was just a cheeky line, really, just a cheeky line. I wasn't gaining it, just a cheeky line. Yes, but Mr. Flanagan, I've got a really important question to ask you. Were you out or were you out out? Just in case anyone forgets. <laughs>